for this movie, I really wanted to do a backstory for our future series. Um, you know, all like kind of the series that we're going through right now. And basically, I wanted to make a character, you know, like, I wanted to, this movie to create a character that we could use. Um, and for many of these scenes in this movie, we used a green screen, not really a green screen, a blue screen. And those scenes um, took a long time. Well, not really that long. Well, it depends on how many takes we had to take. Yeah, I, I am recording. The first scenes that we actually yeah. shot um, in production was the outside scenes where I like run through as a German soldier and well like we did those like around sunset and we cut a lot of parts out from those but still we ran around a lot and it was fun. Bro, you we had that. fun running and filming. Give me a second and once I give you the thumbs up then, then I'll start running. Not cut the video at all, okay? The what? It was fun running through the field, but um, like the main thing was to make it a cool action scene where I was running, like trying to get to somewhere where I could take down the plane, like the dog fight that was about to happen. Yeah. Um, so most of the movie I was either just as a gladiator, American soldier, or German soldier. And basically, um, I had to put on heavy equipment for almost every single time I was on the screen. So it was really tough getting all that equipment on, and it made me sweat a lot, but the, it still looks good. Got all the equipment for the American soldier. Got the boots, the gaiters are stuffed in there. Got the jacket, the pants, helmets on the floor right there, and yeah. I'm getting the boots and gaiters on. Got them on. For the running scene, when the gladiator, uh, the captain, is running through the cabin of the of the plane, um. Well, basically, that was filmed on a treadmill, and we just took out the background and added in, like, windows, like, constantly moving. For the very end of the movie, when the soldier dies, like, that's not the soldier that's going to come back. But, like, the fake blood that we put on me was basically where we drew, like, like we took a marker, drew a line on my forehead, and, like, we covered that with fake blood to make it look more like, a, like I hit my head on fo like when I was falling down on something and cut my head and, and like caused something in my brain and killed me. And basically, he didn't die until that scene in the movie, but still, um, yeah. Alright, so now we're going to be adding in some big blood for the final scene of the movie. So yeah, let's get to work on that.